work that had to be done. Always busting his butt. my heart. Some cool armbands. She put like foam rolls on. 
Chino. All right, uh, we've got lots of awards to give out, and uh, I want to thank everybody who submitted recommendations. We did go through all of them. We had a form online, so hopefully that made things easier for you to submit your recommendations. If you have any feedback about that process, please let us know so we can make that easier for you. Uh, of all the recommendations, a lot of them we're giving out. Some of them might not be given out for different reasons might be because they've already been awarded for the same item at a different event. It could be because you're requesting a title that they've not completed their term yet. So if you read the Gabor, you're supposed to actually finish your term to get awarded titles for your exceptional service. So there could be different reasons. If you didn't get the award that uh, that you submitted and get put out today, then feel free to do that again the next event and say, we still think that this is worthy and maybe it'll happen at that one. So we let's go through that process and. Get that done for people. We've got really cool awards for everyone. Yeah! Yeah! Woo. Yeah! Yeah! Woo. Woo. All right, can I have Jelly Bean before the court, please? No! <laughs> We're not doing that. Uh, yeah. This is one of the, the Neonist traders here yeah. Yeah. Who, uh, who did a very bad job of trying to infiltrate the monarchy's uh, uh, guards. And, and so we were going to use him as the new squishy pillow, but he doesn't look very squishy. To be honest. I don't want him to die. Yeah. Fox has already had a lot of work to do as Metacraft this fit. So uh, we're going to try to give him a little break. but. Trainer right here. Y'all can hit him with swords later. That's totally fine. And he was made an example of. His throat was slit and he is dead on the floor. So all you need is scum. Don't try and attack us. Thank you. Yeah, I need a scum. That's me, be honest. All right. So we're, while well, we're saying that, Jelly Bean's like, why did they call me up here if they're just going to pop it up stuff? Um, so this is a recommendation for Jelly Bean for her helping out at the uh, a Symposium up in Winter's Edge. She's getting her first order of the road. Yeah. Before the court, please. Aiden! Aiden! Aiden. Oh, that's really hard. Oh, it's here. It's here. Don't worry, I missed the way you make me feel. It's real. Ew. Yeah. you are all special. Like, I'll just stand here like you're standing. <laughs> so, Aiden jumped in and helped today with uh, the tournament. Didn't even need to be asked, just saw some work that needed to be done, and so he went and did it, so he's getting his first order of the road. Yeah. Can I have Crusk before the court, please? Crusk! Get it, boy. Yeah. Hey, so, Mike's hat, it's a good piratey hat, art and stuff. 
Arc. 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 So for service to his park, cleaning up and helping out, he's getting his first order of the rose. Can I have Sigrun before the floor, please? Sigrun. Rail on up here. Zoom, zoom. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Roll out. <laughs> very, very shiny. Neil. 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 Yeah. That, that looks great. <laughs> That's acceptable. She got a knee. She got a knee. So also for her service as her bark for helping clean up and helping out, she's getting her first order of the rose. Woo! far what she's done as her champion her remark has been very impressive and she's getting her first order of the lion. Yeah. <laughs> now squee before the court please. So in case you didn't know, this is Squee. Like most of you knew that. <laughs> so Squee is always in character, always role-playing, always calling himself Squee, because that's why he remembers it. And he's getting his first order of the mask. <laughs> Can I get a representative for Rada, please? I guess it's me. That's yeah, you're nice. Someone who's not Susie. <laughs> I get that. Oh, wow. Awesome. So Reda was the regent of her park. Uh, she's finished her term. And she's getting her first order of the lion. <laughs> also for this overall service that she does to help out her second order of the rose. <laughs> Can we have Kitsune to the court? Up here. Can you hold him up? Thank you. Thank you. So for all... Short. <laughs> she'll, you get the candy, she'll get the award. It's all good. For all of the wonderful club coats that you made for your entire family. And not all of our videos you do. Yeah. You know what I'm doing. Before the court, please. You, pirate. Scum. Captain Jack. But you have heard of him. DJ. I'll see if I get some music for that. He's pretty much always a pirate. Private Pirate in his park. Pirate on the boards. Fired at Walmart. He's pretty much fired in the rear. He's getting his first order of the mask. <laughs> also, for the work that he did with the games at their <coughs> pirate event, he's getting his third order of the Smith. Yeah! Nar. Nar. <laughs> <laughs> Say he serves me good. Can I have Etrigan before the court, please? <laughs> Yo, it's gone. See, that's what the tune is about. It really made it Says the guy in all the neon. So much glitter. Yes, the glitter audio tag does. So Etrigan 
did a uh, great weapon making class at the joint mid rain event for Kestrel Keep at Forsaken Hollow. He's also doing another one, I think, later tonight. And last night, so a lot of that. So he's got his first quarter of the Smith. Uh, at the last event, he was the only one in here that was putting up all the tables and chairs. I know because I watched him, you know, because he got to supervise that type of stuff. Uh, so he's getting his second order of the rose. So now giving her her fifth order of the lion for service to the kingdom. Can I have Anna Cena before the court, please? Do not bring any children with you. Sure. Okay. All right, so Anna 
Cena had put in some entries in the last Dragon Master. Uh, one of them was a monster book, which had a lot of color monster pictures. It was really many entries all rolled into one. And so for that, she's getting her second Order of the Dragon. Uh, she also makes a lot of different weapons. Some of them are quite unique. A lot of them are pretty awesome. <laughs> the shield that he made. <laughs> and he also had a couple other items in uh, the event. One of was Best in Show, I believe. So he had a miniature that he not only painted but actually created himself and so he's getting his fifth and his sixth orders of the dragon can i have sir Darian before the court please Alright, so Darian made a um, very impressive night's nice chain right there. Um, he actually posted online a complete write up for how he designed it and created it, which was pretty beautiful. <laughs> and for that, he's getting his sixth order of the dragon. Can I have a representative for Ripper before the court, please? Ripper's here. Ripper. 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 No, I don't want Ripper up here. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's, he's one of those MPA guys. We're just not having that. All right, well, since you're here, um, Ripper was in the Dragon Master at the last event and uh, actually won the Dragon Master at a number of impressive items, high scoring items. And for that, he's getting his eighth order of the owl. Yeah. Huzzah! 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 You don't suck. Can we have Bolt before the court, please? from every person he beat in that tournament because there was a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> so he is going to get his fourth order of the warrior. 
But there was also a recommendation, and it would have been nice if he was here to get this, so maybe we'll just give it to him. Wow. For him to get his Paragon Bard. Wow. Watch the video. Uh, Nap Duskin before the court leaves. No. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's terrible. Terrible news. Huh? So, apparently, Duskin doesn't really like to try very hard. <laughs> and, uh, and I think that's definitely worthy of an award. Because I don't like to try very hard either. That's why I play peasant a lot. Um, but Duskin plays peasant way more than I do, and does a way better job. So he's getting his Paragon Peasant. Yeah! I will sell all your flags in CTF. <laughs> <laughs> you were good, I was there. Can I get Brock before the court, please? Brock! Oh, thanks for that, guys. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> All right, so this recommendation came from one of your park members about your service to their park as champion. And so you're being your, awarded your title of Esquire. from someone from her park for term of service as regent of her shire. She's getting awarded the title of Esquire. Can I have Draz before the court, please? Draz, why are you holding things up, man? I would laugh. This Don't would oh, I would. I was, uh, I'd have laughed. I should have followed him in, just in case he did fall. Yeah. There he is! Yeah. Yeah. Don't rush or anything. Left him at. Do the diligence to the kingdom. Can't fucking speak. So Jazz was the chancellor of the Barony of Forsaken Hollow and was told that he did a pretty good job at that. Maybe even an exceptional job. So I think you can get from that is a title. So I was gonna give him this title, but I don't know. I think he probably needs a better tunic if he's gonna have the title of Lord. Before the court, please. <laughs> I pay her an allowance, you know. How much? I'll scream. <laughs> well, she lives with me, so she has to, you know. <laughs> Don't you pull it out from behind me either. <laughs> I got my eye on you. I want to. Darn traditionalists, can't trust them. <laughs> So Grumpy is your former regent of the kingdom, and then she had to take over as monarch abruptly, <laughs> which, Only I get the point there, huh? <laughs> which she just loved so much you could tell. Um, so she didn't actually finish either term, but she did what was needed to be done for both of them for the benefit of the kingdom, and so I'm recognizing her with the title of lady. Roaring before the court leaves. Copycat. Oh. <laughs> yeah, more air. 
I'm fat. I need more air. Oh, guess. <laughs> so, Roar and Ren are um, weapon master today. You had a lot of help. I want to thank all the Reeves that helped. Those who were fetching arrows, running brackets, fixing brackets. <laughs> uh, he's been the GMR for our kingdom for many different terms. He's reaped a lot. Uh, he does a lot for this kingdom. And uh, I want to give him recognize, especially for getting his walker in the middle. The person's not here, but this is the person that actually creates all of the awards for me. Um, his name is Mordecai, he's from our park. He hates getting awards. So yeah. I'm giving him an attaboy for making all the awards for us. Yeah. Alright, so that's all that I have for awards. Uh, let's, have, let's have Pumpkin Jack come on up, please. Oh, Don't try to jump over here. Uh, just stand right there and turn around and face everybody without hitting the princess. Okay. So, since this is our mid range and we've got a new KPM, we're going to fire catnip. Bye, catnip. Bye, catnip. And we're going to hire Pumpkin Jack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It was my <laughs> Yeah. Oh, don't fill his head any bigger than it is. Jeez, you like such a Announce, close out Alright, so, real quick, I do have a few announcements though. Real quick, I do have a few announcements. Um, if you have receipts, if you grab it for me, uh, I'll be doing, doing closeout after court. Come see me, I'll be over there shortly after court. Um, also, I do want to announce that throughout the term of KPM, I will be doing a couple things. Not necessarily different, but things that we need to do. Um, we're going to be auditing. It's all the fun stuff you guys want to hear about. Auditing, uh, going over the Bora so everybody can learn more about I know, the know. boring stuff that we have to deal with. And hopefully reviving the newsletter. So, right. ooh, yeah. let's see what happens. Newsletter. Newsletter. Yeah. Is there anyone else that has any announcements to come up before court? No. Oh, Tavern Raffle, yes. All right, well, some of you know, uh, we were doing uh, some games at Tavern this weekend, and winning a game got you into a raffle for some special prizes. So, of uh, everyone that competed, we're gonna have two winners, two different prizes. After court, you can come by Tavern and find out what you won. And our first winner of the raffle is Krusk. Krusk! Winner number one! Come see us at Tavern after court. And the second winner is William Turnip. Goblets, jewelry, gift cards. There's, there's 
for you neonists, there's suspenders that are neon that light up. Yeah, I'm winning the fight. Yeah, that's right. They're, um, what are the prizes for winning the actual Holy Garb? So actually, if you if you do place in the Holy Garb, there's going to be two winners, the neonist Garb and the traditionalist Garb. So there's a set of custom cutlery. I posted pictures online about <laughs> black cutlery or rainbow cutlery. Um, you can have your choice of that. There's also a um, reversal belt. So one side is black and the other side is rainbow. And there's another one where one side is black and the other side is uh, silver sparkle. So I posted pictures of those as well. Jay took some great pictures of those. Um, there may be more stuff coming up too, and that's just for the winners. They'll also get to sit at the head table to eat with the crowd. Uh, because we actually got, you know, two first, sort of. Mike, because I sat down first. That's how it works. Uh, but uh, also, thank you, Lady J, for decorating our head table, making these custom owners with the names on them. Table decorations. Um, Y'all did great for that. It's so good to see people come out and get really excited about the game, not just playing the battle games and not just playing in the tournaments, but just overall everything to do with amp card and role playing. And so it's great to see all that as well. Okay. Now, let's fight. All right. Just kidding, Charlie. One more announcement from Tavern. I also wanted to say congratulations to Brutus for winning our Bounty Board Challenge. All right. I don't have anything else. So thank you for attending court. We adjourned. No, wait. We've got one more. <laughs> Almost, we're so close to leaving. Oh, All right, where's my hype man at that I talked to earlier? I don't know. Hey, where's my man at? Sanctuary. Well, I guess Bruce is going to have to see what's going on. I put the trial on the blood. Use your big boy voice. Okay. All right, since I lost my hype man. All right, so this is what's going on. A boss man right here, I need to show that face of dust flag off. If you have it on you. Okay, so. so I'll pretend see. there's a belt flag. There's a belt flag. So, how's the brew runners? Alright, it's an infantry trade in the Midwest, for some reason. But for some reason, I guess the old crook could have a man who to me. So, I relieved it down here. He's going for shot in the house of a couple brew runners, also known as cold brew runners. There's going to be a trial on the seal, hopefully, a few minutes after this is all over. I need 10 bodies to help this man get his trial done. That's it. All right, ten bodies to probably beat them up. Yeah. Sounds like a good plan. Yeah. Please clean up your tables properly before you leave. Yeah. 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 Please clean up your tables properly before you go. Nobody wants to clean up after you if they don't have to. Thank you. So they have to. All right. Anything else, really? Come on. All right, go.